first introduced to the population in the 2011 budget statement, the use of compressed natural gas as a vehicular fuel has changed this country's transportation landscape. Sales and marketing manager of NGC Green, Annalisa Goindu, says this country has benefited in many ways from the introduction of this alternative fuel. From 2014 to 2023, the transformation has been nothing short of inspiring thanks to the unwavering efforts and contributions of our valued stakeholders. The numbers tell a compelling story of growth and impact. The Ministry of Energy and Energy Industries indicates in 2011 almost 4 million litres of CNG were sold on the local market. CNG litre sales have surged from 2.85 million in 2014 to an impressive 25.35 million at the end of 2023, showcasing an outstanding 28% annual average increase. The entire program yielded over 105 million litres of sales displaced in liquid fuels. In terms of the financial impact of CNG on the local market, Ms. Goendu highlights several benefits. The government of the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago has realised substantial savings, totaling approximately TT $400 million in liquid fuel forex saved and an additional $80 million TT in subsidy savings. Described as an environmentally friendly alternative to other vehicle fuels, CNG offers reduced greenhouse gas emissions. Our commitment to a sustainable future is evident in the environmental impact we've achieved, a victory worth celebrating. The CNG initiative has contributed to saving approximately 80,000 tons of carbon emissions, underscoring our dedication to a cleaner and greener future. In 2015, NGC CNG introduced a grant of up to $75,000 to allow maxi taxi drivers to convert their vehicles from diesel to CNG powered engines. The widespread adoption of CNG vehicles is evident with nearly 19,000 sedan equivalents now on the roads and spanning various segments such as passenger cars, taxis, omnibuses, maxi taxis, school buses, commercial vehicles, and the PTSC buses. NGC CNG was rebranded as NGC Green earlier this year. Our CNG network has expanded to 15 stations with more in the pipeline, pun intended. Today, we are honored to have our key stakeholders, including our staff, station owners, and operators, licensed converters, vehicle dealers, regulators, training partners, financial partners, and fuel marketers, as we mark this momentous occasion and look optimistically into the future under NGC Green. Companies across the country have embraced CNG as a fuel, which reduces their operating costs and is in harmony with worldwide efforts to reduce carbon emissions. I am Terry Brown Campbell, and this is Evolving Energy.